Hello heroes and villains, welcome to Multiverse. Uh, some of you guys seem to have uh, some trouble getting access to the cyborg vendor to be able to purchase allies. So I'm going to go through all the steps that you need to go through in order to be able to gain access to cyborg. Although apparently there might be a bug uh, involved in some cases, uh, but again, I will go through all the steps you need to do in order to gain access to cyborg. Hopefully it will be able to help you, at least some of you guys. So let us use our friend, The Flash. So as you log in, you should have a mission called Together Unbroken. I, the Monitor, am gathering the multiverse to face its greatest threat yet. We will need every ally we can get, even unexpected ones. Meet me aboard the House of Legends. So if we take a look at our message, uh, the first one was uh, wait for Monitor to finish speaking, so we did that. So now open your map menu and use the warp menu to teleport to the House of Legends. So let us do that. So if we go to the map menu, warp menu, the very first option at the top is House of Legends. And there's also a portal for the House of Legends in the Watchtower and a portal in the Hall of Doom. But ultimately, you don't really, you don't even need those portals. You can just warp right there. So once you get here, so basically you have to use the little console over here. So if we go back to our journal just to be safe. So talk to the monitor at his projection kiosk in the foyer. So here we are. Heroes and villains, you must prepare for the trials to come. I am needed elsewhere. Harbinger, introduce our guests to Tempest Fugionaut and show them around my house of legends. On your orders. Start with Tempest Fugionaut, guardian of the Orrery of Worlds. So we'll have a few NPCs uh, to talk to. So you just need to go from uh, from one to the next. So here's our friend Tempest Fujinot. So let's talk to him. I open the way to important locations across time and space. For most of your journey, I will have the perfect equipment for you. I hope to see you often. And yes, right now it does take a while for the map to load. I should be like that at least uh, for a few days. Sometimes usually when there's a big update, uh, the game is a bit unstable for at least a few days, maybe a week or two. Hopefully uh, they'll fix that soon. Uh, I guess we'll have to wait and see. So next we have to go to the visit to Episodic uh, Vendor. So it's the little guy over here. The absolute highest tier equipment can be found on an assistant close to Tempest Fugionaut. So here they seem to put the, the vendor from the latest episode. In this case, it's the Flashpoint uh, vendor. So now we have to go to the crafting station, which is right here. Outgrown gear can be sold for cash, or even better, salvaged into exobytes to boost your base stats at R&D stations like these. So now we have to use Arbinger's projector, so it's the one right here. This main observation deck has more important features. John Constantine will help you power up artifacts, Booster Gold will help you stabilize quarks, and Dr. Fate offers daily rewards. Next, your mentors have hired a guide for you in the training area. They have assured me he is a consummate professional. So next, we have to go talk to Deathstroke. Uh, on the test server at some point, uh, the quest was broken because Deathstroke wasn't there. So at some point, I was uh, struggling a bit to show you some of the stuff on the test server. But here, Deathstroke is fine. And also, they gave him a new skin, if I recall correctly. Yeah, they upgraded the, the textures a bit. And he does look uh, kind of neat. Uh, from what I understand, they have dated the texture of pretty much all, well, oh, a lot of the NPCs. Here. Practice against the trainers or reset your skills via this interface. Learn to watch your back because nobody else will watch it for you. Certainly not your so-called mentors. Reminder, the monitor is interested in cooperation. We have one last place to visit before I leave you with allies. So just in case it wasn't uh, self-evident, basically this is... Uh, this is a mission to be able to introduce you to the House of Legends and let you know that uh, basically Deathstroke was where you can go to to the training room to train yourself, try out your powers, try out your loadout and all that good stuff. And here we're going to our friend Ambush Bug. I'm sure you saw him in quite a few of my videos, so now let's talk to him. Ambush Bug, all up in your fourth wall. This room is for you nostalgists. We got old gear you can buy for the cool styles. Teleporters to places you'll maybe visit. Uh, once a year, unlocks for Legends Exobytes, the PvP system with some of DC's coolest characters that could always use more cannon fodder. These last two stops are perhaps the most important to the Monitor. 
First, Chang Zhu is an alien from Apocalypse who has agreed to behave. Uh, why not? I have a video about the, the collections and the briefings. Uh, basically, they give you five source marks, so not really worth it. So Chang Zhu should be on this side here. Ah, there he is. So Chang Zhu is the vendor for the pet, so let's talk to him. Combat pets. Different functions, different power levels, all depending on what you need. And if you have any trouble, I can provide additional support. And finally, Cyborg is developing a method for more easily calling in allies. The tour is complete, but please, see Cyborg next. Rip Hunter here, Time Lord from Vanishing Point. And I need your help to stabilize the weak points in the time stream. Come see me in the House of Legends. Ah, that's a pretty cool looking day. Red Hood. Love it. So, we don't really need to speak to Rip Hunter, but uh, let's, let's do it, uh, because why not? We're already here anyway. Vanishing Point is that much stronger, thanks to you. So now let us go talk to Cyborg. So we're going to be able to talk to Cyborg, but we're not going to be able to purchase items from him just yet. Uh, we're going to have to do a little mission first, so let's talk to him. Can you believe this place? Allies from all across time and space, and I've been working out a system to connect everyone. I started the ball rolling on a basic team for you when something ominous arrived. A Batarang from the Dark Multiverse. With your name, a location under Crime Alley, and instructions to come alone. It's obviously a trap. So if you do choose to go, please be careful. So sadly, we still cannot talk to Cyborg. So we have to play this mission first. And then after that, we might have access to Cyborg. I guess we, we shall see. So let us travel to the Dark Multiverse. This place gives me the creeps. It's like the Batcave, but nightmarish. It has to be the Batman who laughs. This is going to be a problem. Oh no, it's the Batman who laughs. You really walked right into my obvious trap all by yourself? This was almost too easy. Well, let's get rid of a few Robins. There we go. So first we have to... Uh, let's get rid of those as well. So the X tells us to come oh, see here. Sorry. Tough luck. You have to be smarter than that. <laughs> so there's the uh, three shields we have to disable. Oh, let's get rid of those two. Ah, that was bad. Evil Robin. So the first one is here. The second one is over here. Oh, we're going to try to avoid uh, the Robins. We don't have to defeat them all. Ah, I love those Robins. And the last one is right over there. Stay on target. Oh. So that should do it. And now let's confront the Batman who laughs. You are here because I need something from you. And you will need something from me. The hilarious thing is, you won't know what that is until it's too late. So, let's beat each other senseless. Let us do that. Also, you may have noticed, uh, it uh, it lowered our combat rating to combat rating 20. It does that for everyone. Nice. So if you come here and you see your combat rating go down, it's normal. But I brought allies, and you didn't, so I win. I'm going to enjoy this. Here, I've got your back. Ah, uh, Oracle got our back. She's so nice. What a joke. 
I never realized uh, Batman Wives had two maces. Allies will save you. Wind Perpetua is coming. <laughs> Big talk from someone who's going to the deepest, darkest dungeon. And hey, being able to send you allies, pretty clutch. I knew this would be useful. I'll have details for you when you get back. So let's go back to the House of Legends. So once we come back, we can talk to Cyborg once more. That was too close for comfort. I'll set it up so your allies have your back reliably and figure out ways to strengthen your team. Check it out. Also, that is also the first uh, the first time you get an ally. If you're a hero player, you will get Oracle Bot. If you're an evil villain, you will get Calculator Bot. So let's collect our ally. And let's go to our inventory and let's consume her. I might as well equip it before we forget. So if we go to our ally screen. So now we have Oracle that we can actually use. So let's go back to our journal. So we have to complete call for allies. So you have to complete this mission before you can actually talk to our friend Cyborg. So let's complete it. And also the mission gives us our first rare alliance, which we will be able to use to upgrade our Oracle bot if we want to. So now let me plug you with the perfect match. So now that we've done all that, then we have access to the cyborg vendor. So you have to do all of that and you have to do every steps in order to be able to reach this point. And then from cyborg, you will be able to purchase some rare alliance for to upgrade your, your allies, some epic alliance. And the, the allies that we have right now, so Calculator Bot, House of Legend Bot, Oracle Bot. So you can see those for 20 source marks. And then Cyborg, The Flash, and Professor Zoom for 100 source marks each. So there you go, guys. These are all the steps you have to go through in order to be able to purchase items from our friend, the Cyborg Allies Vendor.